Okay, it's uh, the 25th of August, uh, 2021, and Jack and I are taking a short little trip today uh, to Bridgeport, uh, Twin Lakes in Bridgeport, where we're going to just spend one night at Twin Lakes Resort just to get away because we've been working so much. This is a little two-day span that neither of us are working, so we are never really stayed there. We're going to go check it out, and uh, that's it. So, when we get further up the road, we'll be showing you some more pictures. Here we are in the little town of Bridgeport, which is where we're going to turn off the road to go to Twin Lakes. We stopped at the Jolly Cone for lunch, had uh, really nice burgers and fries. And now we're taking a little tour of the town to kind of come around to the beginning. It's a very small town. And we'll uh, film as we're going through it. So, it's pretty nice. I'm not sure what elevation we're at, but I'm guessing somewhere around 7,000 feet. To get here, we had to pass the town of uh, Bodhi, and maybe we'll get a chance to visit Bodhi on one of our travels. We haven't been there in a few years. So the road we're coming up to now is the road through Smith Valley. That is an alternate path to get to Carson City without having to go all the way up by the Walker River. You'll see it's it's hazy from the smoke that's been here for at least two weeks. AQI is 74 right now, so that's it's actually not, not so bad. Yeah. <laughs> but you can still see that the mountains where we're headed are not clear. So this is the direction that we're going, right straight back up in there. We have to get through the town and then make a left-hand turn. So now we're entering the actual small city of Bridgeport, which is maybe three blocks long. So how long is it once we turn off of this highway? Um, I'm guessing we're 10 miles. 10 miles, okay. We go across the valley where all those cattle are grazing and then we turn up into the hills, but we don't go too high before we run into the resort and the, and the Twin Lakes themselves. So here is the barn where there's some people eating, followed by Jolly Cone where we ate. There's already somebody in our spot. Yes, there is. The brewery and eatery, right there with Clint, when we came back from Carson City a couple weeks ago. It is quite a cute little town. Uh, yeah. You can see that we're just about completely through the town. And the second to last exit is where we turn off to go to Twin Lakes. Oh, I guess 10 miles, it's 13 miles. 565 for gas here. Diesel, 599. Whew. Okay. Do we have full? Oh, we don't have a full tank. Well, I don't think we'll be paying 569 though. So. Okay. We're gonna go buy it and go buy some Twin Lakes. This is where we're going to stay. Looks pretty unshady. <laughs> we could have gone there for free. Ooh, look at this. Well, they both 
say RV Resort or Twin Phillips Resort. where we're staying. There was one spot available up here, but it looked a little tight, a little bumpy. A lot of pine cones. Yeah. So we're going back down where I think it'll be hotter, but we'll see. So, I'm explaining what I've done. Here we are at the resort. <laughs> Loosely resort. This is some sort of a configuration that we've never seen before, but they have you parking in a little roundabout thing, like a circle. So, we're at number 14. As you can see, there are no trees around. It's pretty... Or shade of any kind. Or shade of any kind. So... We have a nice view, it would appear. We're going to be in number 14, which is over here. It's a back end. It looks pretty straightforward. Down there is where I want to get the Watch it from. Yeah, I see. So, I'm going to leave you now because this is the most fun part of our trips. <laughs> I'm going to direct Jack how to back in. We and, have the most yeah. fun doing this. Yeah. Okay.